Steen has officially signed with WWE. The announcement was made this past week. They showed a photo of him online posing with Triple H at the NXT arena. Apparently that photo was taken a couple of months ago. They've been holding it. They've been waiting. They wanted to make the announcement on the same day that the WWE Network launched in Canada, which it did on Tuesday. And by the way, I've been getting a lot of uh, less than stellar reviews on that from you guys up north on the uh, the network in Canada so far. To uh, to show how high they are on Kevin Steen, and this was a, a note that was uh, mentioned in the most recent Observer newsletter. Reportedly, Dean Ambrose was told not to do Kevin Steen's running cannonball into the corner move anymore because they want that to be a new move for Steen when he comes to the main roster. And if that's true, if they're already thinking uh, about Steen on the main roster, because he is going to hit NXT first, the question, of course, is how long do they keep him there? I think that's got to be a positive sign for Kevin Steen in terms of, A, they have plans for the guy, and B, maybe he won't spend too much time after all at NXT. Uh, So he's in. Again, not exactly a big secret, nor was it when Devitt, you know, when they made the announcement about Devitt, uh, when they made the announcement about Kenta, but all three are now officially announced. They are in. Uh, Steen is reporting to NXT, uh, to the Performance Center, I should say, on August 25th, so next week. I think that's next Tuesday, I want to say. Uh, maybe next Monday. He'll be reporting to the Performance Center, so he is in. We had another first-round tag team match in the tournament, Kalisto and Sin Cara against the new team of Buddy Murphy and Wesley Blake. Kalisto won it for his team, so they meet Sami Zayn and Adam Rose in the next round. Someone uh, posted on my Facebook page earlier in the week an idea for Adam Rose getting hurt and Sami Zayn being left without a partner. And his new partner turns out to be Kevin Steen. I actually love that idea. Uh, it's the only way I could justify Zayn and Rose being, uh, you know, put together as a tag team and then beating Tyson Kidd and Justin Gabriel last week like they did. If they were to make it all the way to the finals, let's say, but Adam Rose gets taken out by the Ascension or something before the match, something happens, and it looks like it's going to be a handicap match and Zayn's all by himself, and all of a sudden, Steen walks out and they win the titles, they beat the Ascension. You know, they're the ones to finally dethrone the Ascension and pave the way for the Ascension then to move on and make their main roster debut, which has been rumored for a while now. You know, that's an idea that I can get behind. I assume that does not happen, and instead we wait for, uh, you know, Stephen Keen to make his NXT debut. Maybe they'll call him uh, Kelvin Stream, something like that. That's probably more realistic. Uh, 